Welcome to Shiraz Enterprise 47, your Etsy fashion store. Shop with the confidence. Hurry up now, 30% off. Find the link in the description. Khloe Kardashian recently disclosed on the She MD podcast with Dr. Thais Aliabadi and Mary Alice Haney that she had Tristan Thompson, her ex-boyfriend, undergo three paternity tests to establish if he was the biological father of their son, Tatum, during the podcast. Kardashian shared that Thompson was deeply hurt by her repeated doubts about Tatum's paternity. She explained, I made Tristan do three DNA tests for Tatum. He was so offended. Kardashian's uncertainty stemmed from Tatum's physical resemblance to her brother, Rob Kardashian, rather than to Thompson or herself. This led her to wonder if Rob could potentially be Tatum's father. My son looks just like my brother and my brother's one of my favorite people, Kardashian explained. Because he was an IVF baby or a surrogate baby, I was like, Rob, have you ever donated sperm somewhere? Despite her suspicions, Kardashian's doctor reminded her that she had already conducted a DNA test. However, she insisted on another test to resolve her doubts, this isn't the first time Khloe Kardashian has faced paternity speculation. Khloe Kardashian has been the subject of persistent rumors suggesting that her father might be O.J. Simpson for years, these rumors gained traction after Kris Jenner's memoir hinted at an affair during her marriage to Robert Kardashian. However the thermometer has repeatedly denied any relations with Simpson. I in November 2021, Kardashian and Thompson opted to use a surrogate for their embryos, shortly after, Kardashian learned that Thompson was expecting another child with a different woman. The news of Thompson's other paternity test left Kardashian feeling vulnerable and overwhelmed by the criticism and media scrutiny she faced. She said, it devastated me, because that's when all the judgment and the knives were thrown at me. Though Kardashian is no longer with Thompson following a myriad of scandals, the 39-year-old insisted there was no bad blood between the two. My ex, Tristan, is an incredible father. I don't want this to be a bashing thing she said. He made, a, mistake, but he's the nicest guy. And we get along so well now. We're not meant to be together, but he was meant to be the father of these kids. I've seen some other fathers that are not great fathers, and I'm very grateful that I have one that wants to be in their lives, that's active every single day even though he doesn't live here full time.